This is the Lightwave RF Wi-Fi link which allows you to control your devices across the network. But $100, I thought it was a bit of a rip-off, so I wondered whether I could hack one of these Lightwave RF mood controllers to do the same thing directly from a Raspberry Pi. Here's the mood controller which I opened up. To open these up, there's a hidden screw under the label, so just peel that back and undo the screw. Next up is there's a bunch of these tabs uh, which were quite tricky to get off. I used one of these, I think it's called a spludger, just to go around the edge and release all the tabs. I also removed the circuit board, uh, which is held in by these tabs here. So just splay out the case and you should be able to pull out the circuit board. The important controls which we want to use are the power down, power up and also the device selector. So here are those controls on the circuit board itself. So they all share the same ground. Uh, so I just need one ground connector and then I soldered wires onto each of the switches which I needed. The fourth position of the switch isn't actually used because it knows that if the first three are off then it must be in the fourth position. I soldered the header onto the end and now it's ready to try. So here it is connected to the GPIO pins of the Raspberry Pi. So if I run my control program it's turning it on, wait a few seconds, sends turn off. So there you have it. The obvious disadvantage of this method is that you can only control up to four devices, but that might be enough for some people and it saves around $80.